When I was in my 20s, I revolved my identity around being a musician, being kind of a hippie type of person, being a nature lover kind of person, and I still have a lot of that today, but um, I'd like to make more music. But uh, eventually, uh, by the time I reached my 30s, I started revolving my identity around the fact that uh, I was a gainer. I wanted to be a bear. I wanted to be a bear is a, in the gay community is a uh, kind of a burly bearded, usually hairy. And I've never been that hairy. So I never met that uh, quota, but, uh, and, and often a heavy set, uh, kind of guys, a masculine and, uh, <clears throat> I started identifying in that way. And uh, the whole gaining thing led me to getting to just about 300 pounds, and that was crazy. And, and then I eventually realized how stupid the whole thing was. And uh, and then realized, hey, that's that's not something to revolve your identity around, right? But... You know, now I'm I'm back to you know I'm I'm a musician, I'm a nature lover, I'm a narrator, I'm a uh, social commentator, I'm a, I'm a photographer, um, that sort of thing. That's what I revolve my identity around now. But I think about what would it have been like if I would have been raised in today's society and in, in in the way that. Kids are being taught in, in some schools where some people are pushing this notion, you know, what are your pronouns and how do you identify? And, and then they'll have all these flags, you know, uh, uh, representing a bunch of different sexualities and different identities. And man, if, if I would have had pu had that sort of thing pushed on me as a kid, then it would be... I, I would feel this massive connectedness with the whole LGBTQIAA2S plus side of things. I would have felt very, very connected to that. And if I couldn't connect to that, if I, let's say I would have been straight... It, it just would have felt kind of alienating, but just if I would have been pushed into the notion that I should revolve my identity around my sexual interests or what gender that I that I might identify as, that would have been very hard to get out of that, to be able to start identifying as you know, the things that I actually have interest in. I mean, I mean, some people, I guess, their only interests are sexuality. And I guess for a period of time, that was kind of my thing when I did the whole gaining thing. But that's not, that's not healthy. You are more than your sexuality. You are more than your gender. You are more than your race. You are more than that. And I find it incredibly sad that... Identity politics has taken over so much stuff. I mean, some people will say, well, all politics is identity politics, and there's some truth to that. There is some truth to that. But what are you basing your identity around? You know, that's kind of important. I guess I don't know what more to say right now. I just, I just wish there was more of a push for people to be a little deeper, to be a little more, God, what was the word I'm trying to find? I, I, I'm ruining the video as I, as I, as I fumble with these words. So I think I'm just going to end the video. Thanks for watching.